For families that rely on federal help for food, the shutdown could leave them with an empty table. It's going to affect me because then I won't be able to come in here and buy my groceries. Absent a deal between President Donald Trump and Congress, federal funds for food assistance could run out next month, affecting some of the 38 million Americans who rely on the program for their basic needs. A lot of people are one paycheck away from being in the situation of needing food assistance. And it's really a challenge for us to get people to realize how broad an issue it is. The Department of Agriculture has only guaranteed that eligible households will receive monthly supplemental nutritional assistance program benefits for January, but made no promises for February. A Washington Post analysis says the program has only $3 billion in reserve, which would cover just 64 percent of February's obligations. If the uh, shutdown continues, then you will literally have millions of people that will not be able to afford food. And I think this is just absolutely unconscionable. It's possible states could step in and cover the shortfall in the short term. But tonight, there are signs that the White House is bracing for a long-term shutdown. The Council of Economic Advisors is preparing for the impasse to affect January's unemployment rate due to be made public February 1st. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.